What is up guys, Rhythm Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today guys, I've got something super awesome for you. Brand new, massive abandoned mansion. Had my eye on this for a while. Finally came with Zanny with Zay. Wide open, good to go. So anyways guys, let's check it out. All right guys, so this mansion, absolutely huge. You'll see this, but it's very unique too. Like look at the medallion, how it's kind of like little spikes hanging down that are all glittery. And a nice big chandelier. So obviously guys, that would put us in the dining room. And right off the dining room, of course, is this massive kitchen. And as you can see, based on the tile, backsplash and everything. It's an older mansion. It's not one of these newer ones that does seem to be getting demolished all the time. This is an old, old mansion. Got yourself an old intercom system in there. And like, look at these doors with that frosted glass privacy. So over here, guys, this will be the front door right over in this area. And then you got this massive, massive living room. Still got a couch there. But like, look at the size of it and look at the carpeting. Very, very ugly carpeting. And there's lots of it. And again, over here, this is, takes us over to the kitchen. Sorry, guys, still fighting this cold off. So I am a little stuffy. And look at this door. Just gorgeous. And that glass you got there. We'll go in there in a second, guys, because there's something really, really awesome that I love that I want to show you, but we're going to tour the rest of this place first. Got a staircase over here. Again, guys, we'll go up there after. Got a bedroom. And if you guys are wondering, oh, this is too clean, you can see all around this skylight, there is decay starting everywhere. So it's not like this place is just an empty for sale house. Got a bedroom back here. Nice big walk-in closet. But looking at the doors and everything, I'm, t I'm saying this is probably like the 60s. With some updates later on. But a lot of the original stuff seems to be from probably the 60s. And a mansion from that time, this is a big one. So we'll go up over here, or actually, let's go this way first, guys. So you got a back closet here. It's a little laundry room. Lots and mops, because this place has lots of floor. It's a little closet there, nothing in it. Got another small bedroom here. Very small, actually, considering probably a kid's room or an office, hard to say. This is super cool right here, guys. Look at this. And that plant there, you can see it's definitely thirsty. It needs some water. Then over here, we got another, I got a bathroom. I think this is the first one we've seen, but we've got a mirror there for me to say, what is up, guys? Now this is like an enclosed patio kind of area. And right in here, guys, that's where the dining room is. Kind of where we started off. Well, actually, exactly where we started off. We'll go down to the basement, because I think you guys need to see this. And then we'll tour the upstairs. And there's lots of stuff I can't wait to show you guys, both downstairs and upstairs. This is a good one. So check this out. Huge, huge basement. And look at this. We have a mirror right there. What is up, guys? But look at this. Foosball table. And there's a thick layer of dust on everything. Got a pool table here. 
Everything's still there for snooker. No pool balls, but snooker balls. And look at this fireplace. Wow. Look, seriously, guys, this place is gorgeous and huge. And over here, check out the bar. This is so cool. I wonder if the lights work. Holy crap, guys, the power works. So look at this. Is that not cool? Crazy that the power's working when you guys saw that decay that was happening. Always turn the lights off. Now, what's going on over here? There's a board block in this door. Super moldy here, guys. What's this? That's locked. Oh, the mold is stinky in here. I feel like we're out, out underneath the, the cold room, so it's underneath the stairs. This looks like it goes outside. We're not going to go out there. We don't need to go outside, guys. But super decayed. Put this back. But yeah, gotta love it. Pool table, foosball table. Most places don't even have enough space for one of these items. And these guys got two of them in their basement and acres of space. Oh, nice wood stove there. Weird, look at these tiles. What's this back here? Oh, it's like a secret room. What the hell? Whoa, this is so weird. Look at all these pieces of wood. Oh, you know what? That's probably just wood for the, uh, the wood stove. All that hardwood offcuts. But this is a strange room. And there's a light on, which is also quite strange. Oh, oil heaters or oil, oil tanks for an oil furnace. And look at this. Where would it off wall? Weird. This place is pretty crazy. Okay, Let's see what else we can find here, guys. This is a little storage underneath the stairs. Oh, this looks like it goes outside too. Oh yeah, it does. Huh. Basement walkout. Place is big, you need to have access or for escaping, you know, if there's a fire. Got a small little kitchenette down here. Perfect for having parties. You got someone cooking food in there. Got some roughins for, it's like uh, sinks and toilet maybe. Yeah, the toilet, like that bag over there, that's covered in the poo pipe. Oh, but there's a toilet right here. And a full bathroom. And like, don't forget about what is up guys ew the toilet's pink and rotten so again more proof guys that this place is clearly abandoned some weird random rooms well that's for wine making little storage there is plenty of storage in this place I'm, I'm finding looks like a laundry room there's your massive furnaces. Another just empty room. Weird. A lot of empty rooms, a lot of just mystery rooms, guys. Not even sure what a lot of these places are. But that seems to be it for the basement. Now we're going to go upstairs. And that's where I can't wait to show you some more stuff. Because you got to love that foosball table and everything. Foosball and snooker. <laughs> and look at the tile <laughs> so now I get to show you guys what I was really excited about when I came in here look at this 
Look at this spiral staircase. Is this not incredible? And up top, you got a nice chandelier with another one of those spiky uh, medallions. All right, guys, let's go check out the, the stairs. I never didn't go down here before. Oh, so what's going on? This is weird. Oh, looks like there was a fire on the stairs here. Look at this. Someone set fire to the stairs. Wow, that could have been bad. Interesting. Oh, and here is where we came in before, guys. So that's on the other side of that locked door. So there really isn't much to this staircase. It just goes down into really nothing. It's kind of blocked off from the rest of that really nice basement area. But anyways, let's keep on moving. I love these staircases, but I do not like the carpeting. Look at this, guys. Absolutely beautiful. Can we look right down? Wow. So let's head off to the right here. Looks like another kitchen. I wonder if this was uh, like um, used for multiple apartments or something. Some equipment in here, net gear, interesting. Another big bedroom, or room, I don't know if it's a bedroom or not. I'm just speculating here, guys. <coughs> Excuse me. But what I noticed is that there's internet lines dropped all over the place here. So I'm wondering if this was after it was used as a mansion, if it was like a house, if it was used for some sort of business. And this looks like the same thing too, because you got two lines right there, cat five lines. And this is definitely set up like an office area. Yeah, big filing cabinet there. Really dated bathroom, but you know what we gotta say is what is up, guys? Interesting. All right, let's continue on, guys. What's down here? Holy crap, guys. Friggin' Ninja Turtles at Donatello scared the crap out of me. Wow, it's like a life-size Ninja Turtle. <laughs> Got a bedroom over here, Donatello garden. Look at these doors, they're actually pretty fancy uh, closet doors there. by these beauty stairs once again. So little hall closet. Yeah, nothing in there. Got a bathroom with a bidet. That's the first bidet we've seen in this mansion. Ah, I think I figured out why this place was abandoned, guys. Look at how improperly that toilet paper roll is put on. That is definitely why this place is abandoned. just keeps on going forever. What's back here? Oh, it's a closet. Big closet. Wow. What's this? Like a little office or something? Weird. But again, we've got a skylight here, guys. And there is decay all up that sure you guys can see that. No fooling around. Redham Riders got that epic shit and that bando shit. Another skylight with, you know, bubble and paint. Because again, this is weird. 
It's just like a secret little, well, I guess it's not a secret, it's pretty obvious, but it's just a weird cubby. Random. Closet. Oh, another set of stairs. Oh, okay, we passed these stairs before. Okay. Now it's all making sense, guys. All right, guys, well, that's the end of this epic adventure. Old abandoned mansion. This place was friggin' huge. We got a spiral staircase. We got the epic bar downstairs. We got the snooker table. We got the foosball. And that's pretty much anything I'd want to see when I'm doing Urbex. But anyways, guys, tell me what you think in the comments down below. If you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe. Smash the like button. Remember, guys, always come back, because Rhythm Rider always has that epic shit. All right, thanks for watching. Peace.